Hey guys, how's it going? And I hope everybody is alright due to the whole fiasco with Hurricane Matthew. So I really do hope that all of you are alright, you're safe, and yeah, I just hope that everybody was safe during that time. So I do have another product review for you, but before I begin, I just want to let you know that I recently purchased a brand new camera and I'm using it to film this review right now, so I'm not entirely sure how this footage is going to show up. So if it looks a little wonky, I do apologize because I'm still trying to get my feel on this new camera. It's not really that expensive anyway, it's just a typical point and shoot. But anyway, I'm going to be reviewing a product today, and yes, it is going to be from Shea Moisture. And it's going to be this stuff right here, which is the Raw Shea Butter Soap. And here's what the actual soap bar looks like. Now, it does look a little bit small. It's actually much bigger than this, about the size of this wrapper anyway. But the only reason it even looks like this is because I've been using it several times since I first got it, which was like, I think it was like back in August maybe July I don't even remember exactly but I know that you can find this particular bar in several different stores I'm talking Target possibly uh, Walmart I know for a fact you can find it there Ulta Beauty is another one Walgreens is another place and I think there are like a few other stores that you can find this at and I'm pretty sure the price is like between based on what I've researched the price is somewhere between I'm going to say $4.50 to around 5 bucks just for this bar of soap. Now, if you're familiar with Shea Moisture, then you're probably familiar with their kinds of soaps, especially the, especially in particular the African Black Soap Bar, you know, the big black one. But I decided to pick this up because I've been wanting to try this bar for a while and actually to be honest, I've tried this before but it was in a much smaller bar form, I think it was only like 3 ounces. You know, like those little bitty facial bars that they have. They actually had this in a smaller bar form, but I didn't give it enough time to actually give it a good review because I was just impatient with it. And plus, wherever I was living at the time, it had a lot of hard water. So, I decided to go ahead and pick this bar up again and try it again. Like I said, this is what it looks like. The only reason it's shrunken up is because I've been using it. The smell is pretty mature. Yeah, that's pretty much the only way I can describe the fragrance. It's very mature. You can definitely smell the frankincense and the myrrh in it, but you can also smell a slight hint of the shea butter that's been used because, well, it says right here that shea butter is the first ingredient, and you know shea butter is the signature ingredient if you like shea moisture. But simply put, this bar of soap is really, really good. I absolutely love it. And I say that because not only is it an excellent body soap, it's also an excellent facial soap. And I have yet to use this on my hair, but I'm thinking about trying that in the future because I did read some reviews of people trying it on their hair. And I really do want to see how well it does for my hair. But I've used this for my body and I love the lather of this. It's very creamy yet foamy. And yet it's easy to work with. It gets me nice and clean. and what I recommend if you're going to use this soap is shower in warm water. Don't shower in scalding hot water. Now if you like to take cold showers then my gosh go for it. That's you. But I recommend not using the soap in scalding hot water because not only will it deplete the soap very quickly to where you won't get many uses out of it, but you won't really receive the, the moisture factor that you get with this stuff. This soap makes my skin really really soft and not stripped at all. In fact, if I shower in warm water and I wash my body with it, I find I don't really need to use a lot of lotion because the shea butter, the overwhelming amount of shea butter in this just does all the moisturizing for my skin. And, excuse me, this is coming from somebody with dry body skin, okay? So this is an absolute plus and I really, really love it. And of course, it does the usual thing that a bar of soap will do. It cleans off the dirt, oil, and grime and stuff like that. So I usually come out smelling very fresh and moisturized and clean. For my face, it pretty much does the same thing. Although sometimes there have been cases where I did feel like my skin was a little too, I guess, stiff? I guess my I guess in terms of that my face would sometimes get a little stiff every time I would use this soap. But otherwise, 
I ended up figuring out the problem was warm water. Again, I was using um, cold water, which in this case, it wasn't really working for me. And I used warm water and immediately the problem just went away. But on my face, it definitely gets rid of the oil and it actually controls the oil. And I find that the more that I use this, the clearer my skin stays, okay? I haven't been using this for a while and I've been trying to get back to it because I got too many products I'm trying to get through right now. But I find that the more that I use this soap, the clearer my face stays. It stays clear for a very long time. And I find that most pimples don't really show up, unlike this one that showed up because, well, we're near mid-October anyway, and you know, you ladies probably understand that time of the month. But I find that hardly any pimples have showed up on my face. It's much more even, it's much more toned, it just overall looks good. So I don't really have much negative things to say about this soap here. I just want to tell you that if you really want to try this soap, I guarantee you, you can there you can be using this for a very long time because you'll get a lot of bang for your buck. Hmm. Thought I heard something. Okay, but if you want to use this soap, you'll get a lot of bang for your buck. And I don't really have much negative things to say about this soap. You just have to go try it, okay? Five out of five stars. Definitely will purchase this soap again. I absolutely love it. If you haven't seen the wrapper, this is what it looks like here. If you've actually tried this soap before, please let me know how it worked for you in the comments below. I would love to hear it. And just to let you know, I am still in the process of working on the giveaway. I do want to do a second giveaway. I just need to figure out which products I want to include in the next bundle, for the next prize bundle for the giveaway and what questions I would like for you to answer. So just stay tuned for that. Right now I'm busy working on a photo project and everything and pretty much if you suffered the worst from Hurricane Matthew, my wishes are out to you. I really really would like for you to just stay safe and I hope you recover as fast as you can from what the hurricane did to us. So good luck, be safe, and I will see you in the next video, okay? Bye-bye, guys.